Sure, let's go to the Eclipse Room. Why not? So this has a hallway here, and then it goes down. Okay, if it goes down here... Yeah, I don't know what side we're on still. Yeah, it might be a map of this floor. It might not be. So maybe this will lead us to the dagger. Because I want to try to find the dagger room now. Okay, so this is a dead end. Okay. I'm trying to see. On the map here, there oh, there's a lot of dead ends. I'm looking at the map that I have drawn. So dead end. Take a right. I don't know if either side really match this. And then take another right. Oh, maybe we're on the left side. Yeah. So, hold on. If, oh, yes, I think we are on the left side. Okay, hold on. So, if I go... If I go here... I just want to, I just want to try this out. So, if I go here, and then up here... This should be, uh, oh, wait, what is this? Who are you, friend? Uh, can I have that? Shield looks pretty sturdy. I guess we'll take this. That's the remains of some ancient Mayan. Yeah. Warrior. The spear he's holding is tied to his hand with a piece of cord. Oh, can I? Maybe he was some Can I take the sentinel, cord? But now he's just a pile of dusty bones. Uh, can I take the cord? I guess. Yeah, take the cord. The hemp cord isn't going to come off without being cut. I mean, we have we have the black dagger. Okay, use the black dagger on the cord. I guess the stone dagger's just for looks. Oh, come on! You're telling me you can't cut. What about the jackknife? I thought this thing had a working blade on it. I guess the cord is made of hemp. Burns real nice, or so I've been told. D can I not take it? The hemp cord isn't going to come off without being. Can I not? I, I thought the jackknife could use it. Okay. That doesn't seem to do anything. Okay, so we need something sharp. We do not have something sharp. This door won't open. I'll have to enter through another okay. door. Okay, interesting. All right, good to know. All right, so up here, I think I know where we are. I think we're on the left side of where I drew the map in the top right corner of it. I think so. So if I go here, and then I want to go... Through here, I think this is where we are. And then I should go around here, and then it'll be almost immediately a left. Yes. Okay, I think I know where we are. If this is where I think we are, this should lead to a dead end, and it should coil around itself. Like, this should turn around, and it'll turn right, and then right, and then right. Okay, yes. So, I, I, we are where I thought we were. Uh, hold on, what is this? Small stone bowl. Looks like it's in remarkably good condition. Okay, I'll, t I'll take the stone bowl. Why not? Okay, so I do know where we are. Okay, so right now, it, it, where I drew the map, we're in the center of this floor. And up this way. So yeah, this is back to the room, which is the, the far left side of that. Okay, so go down and then... Oh, actually, no. This leads to a dead end. According to my drawing, at least. I drew it correct. So, this actually loops back on itself. So, this should go around here. And then... Ah! Well, well, well! Looks like some sort a of... A ceremonial, ceremonial dagger. dagger! I'll take that. Is it sharp? It looks sharp. I mean, who knows, though? Apparently, our dagger is no... Is no... You know, fresh blade... So, let's go back and get the cord then. There we are. Okay. Yes, so we do know where we are. Excellent. I guess the stone dagger's just for looks. Really? Really? Got anything tougher than pudding. Really? I, I can't, like, combine these two? Like, I can't use the jackknife to sharpen them? Can I, can I not examine this? My knife used to have all the cool attachments. Now everything's So, yes, this does not have a knife. It has... Oh, that's a shame. It does not have it. It's got a screwdriver head, a looks like a maybe like a can opener and pliers. Oh, that's frustrating. Okay. But I do know where we are. So that's good. All right, so let's go back. All right, so this leads to another dead end at the end here, but there might be an item. It seems like almost every dead end here has something. Not seeing anything here. Oh, 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 what do we have here? 
Um, what is but this? Edson's gun was damaged by one of the Oh, lines. okay. So we have a gun. It's an ancient Coleman lantern. I wonder how long this thing's been here. I mean, we have ma a matchbox, so maybe we can light this thing when we need it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> apparently, it's just leaking. It's just leaking. Uh, so now we have a lantern fuel. Um, can I combine that with the bowl? Like, can I store it there? No. Okay, so we have a lantern fuel. Interesting. Uh, let's examine the gun. Looks like some dirt got jammed in the barrel. It's pretty much useless in this condition. Okay, but we do have the bullets. Okay, we have bullets. Can we examine the bullets? Like, can I take the gunpowder out of them? Firearm. These aren't worth much. Okay, but we do have the bullets. So maybe, hey, again, maybe we're going to use them at some point. What's this? Mm, a pair of thick lens glasses. Hmm. I mean, I'll take them. Uh, prescription prescription These glasses. These aren't much good. The lenses might be useful. All right, so we have a whole lens and a, a broken lens. Okay. Man, the prescription on this lens is pretty strong. Hmm. It's like the magnifying glass I used to burn ants with. So maybe we're going to use it to start a fire somewhere. I think that's the implication. Um, is there anything in this pile? Yeah, you're not looking so good, buddy. Unless I miss my guess, this is Oliver Edson. Oh. Looks like he was in the wrong place. So this is O.E. From the, from the uh, initials that we found. What's this? It's a handkerchief. Sure, why not? Take the handkerchief. Can we combine the handkerchief with the lantern oil? Like, are we creating, like, a Molotov cocktail? Yes. Yeah, I think. I think that's what we're doing. So we're doing, um, what is this? An oily handkerchief. <laughs> and we have the mind shield. Is there anything that we can examine about this? No, it's literally just a shield. Fair enough. Okay, uh, just want to make sure we're not forgetting any items here. So this is Oliver Edson. Okay, so this is the guy who disappeared, who the puzzle box got sent back. Gotcha. Okay, well, let's go back to the room and take the other half of the path. Because this does not connect to the other side. I uh, just want to make sure we're not leaving any other items around here. They do love just squirreling away little items on the floor. In spots you might not have been paying too much attention to. So, this is where the shield guy was. Uh, over here is where Edson was. It's a little hard to tell from here. But yes, so this is where Edson was. This is this, where the shield guy is. So we wrapped all the way back around here. So now we want to go in, I think, the southern part, which would be... So we went out Eclipse. So I think we want to go out through this side? Because we came in through the area. Okay, so yes, we want to go in through or out through this side, the the full sun. Let's call it the full sun. Yeah, I think this is where we want to go. So if I go down to the end of this hallway, it's just the scale of it. That's what was confusing. The scale of my drawing is off. Uh, this should go over here. Excellent. And then it should go down. And there should be a path here. And then down here, there should be two dead ends. So I'm going to go around. Ah, what do we have here? Appears to be some kind of hatchet. Is it sharp? Apparently nothing's sharp. This hatchet doesn't look sharp enough to cut a cantaloupe. Yeah, no. It's some kind of Mayan. It's ever, uh, apparently they didn't keep any sharp instruments around here. Okay, so there should be another dead end, though. If I drew this correctly, which I thought I did... There should be another one down here. No? So I think, no, no, I, I know where I am. So I'm back on the main center path. So I go down. There's a right turn here. So there should be another dead end at the end of this hallway around this corner. Yes. Okay, yes. And what do we have here? It's another of those ceremonial uh -huh. daggers. So now we have three ceremonial daggers. Okay, so this one has three stars on it. Good to know. And then the white dagger has maybe like a sun, like with rays from the sun. And then the black dagger, dagger has the, black has the eclipse. Engraved on it. Yes, it it's the black sun. Uh-huh. So I'm assuming these will have to be used in the dagger room that we saw on the map. Okay, great. 
All right, let's go back over here. Now we're on the, the long horizontal path. And there should be a path over here to the right at some point. That's a dead end. I think this is it. So it should go around the corner here. Oh, there's nothing here this time. I think this is the first time we went to a dead end. There's nothing waiting for us. Uh, I guess let's look on the floor. Make sure we're not missing anything. Yeah, I don't see anything around here. Nothing in the wall or anything. Is that a hole in the wall? No. Okay, I guess there is nothing on in this one. All right, let's keep going. So let's go back up to the path. And then this is where I think it's going to transfer to the next floor. We still didn't find a way to get that cord off of him, right? Yeah, we're going to have to find a sharp knife at some point. So yes, I think this is it. This is the stairs that will take us up. Aha! Excellent. So yeah, this is going to connect to the other floor. Or I guess the other part of the temple. I don't know if it's on another floor or it's just a longer part of the building. Okay, so what is this? Hold on, what? 13 gemstones. 13 gemstones attached hmm. to the top of this altar. The stones are slightly chipped and cracked. Okay. So they've been struck with something repeatedly. Hmm. Maybe this is some sort of Mayan... So maybe this is where we use the hatchet. So, like, the blunt hatchet? Okay, we do not have a pattern for this. I don't think so. Uh, is it on the shield? Is there anything on this? No, not that I see. Okay. All right, so we're going to have to find some sort of arrangement of these colors somewhere. And so this is the black sun door. I think that's where we came in. So let's open this up. Well, I guess the door isn't going to open until I do something. Ah, like darn. Okay. Yeah, no, nothing there. Okay. Uh, maybe this is just like a Simon Says, or maybe maybe we just have to brute force it? Um, yeah, unfortunately, musical puzzles are not my forte. Is there anything in this room that would give a hint to this? No, no, like puzzle pieces like in the last one. Yeah, I don't see anything around here. Nothing on the altar itself. Nothing on this. This could be nothing more than a large Mayan billboard. Yeah. Yeah, it might be lower, lowest pitch to highest pitch. But yeah, that's a tough one. Oh, look at this. Okay. So what is this telling me? The pictures on the wall yeah. are some kind of musical celebration. In one section, two mines are going okay. for two gemstones between them. Hmm. Could mean that the gemstones on the altar can make sense. Yeah, I wonder if it's they have, have to seen. match, they have to harmonize. Maybe that's it. Okay, well, let's try that. See if we can't match the tones. Okay, so we need to try to match these somehow. Oh, I'm so bad at these kinds of puzzles. Yeah, this is going to be tricky. I don't have a, a super good ear for this kind of stuff. Okay, these sound... Oh, okay, that sounds similar. All right, I guess they blacked them out if they're similar. What was the other one? I thought it was these two. Oh, no. Okay, we have to do it in order, I think. Maybe? I thought that one... I thought it was these two that sounded similar, too. So we know these two are correct. Okay. Um, oh, but it's a sequence. Okay. All right. This is not going to be good for us. Several days later. Okay. These two sound the same as well. Okay. So I think I get the order. So boom, boom. Okay. This wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. Oh, no. Hold on. There we go. Okay. Thought I screwed it up there for a second. Like that. And then th this one sounds like you. Okay, good. And then you sound like this one. Great. And then perfect. Awesome. Okay. I think I can remember that. That wasn't too bad. Uh, and then it went, I think it was opening this door, right? 
Okay, I think this is the door I want to be in. Okay, so according to my drawing, this goes all the way across. There are two little dead ends over here. Okay, I don't see any items this way. And there should be another dead end right here. Okay, and nothing here either. That's unfortunate. Okay. I want to be thorough. All right, so then... Okay, yes, yes, yes. So it goes both forward here and to the right. If I go up here, it should go left. Yes, okay. So my map is still correct. Yep, no, good, good, good. And then there should be a dead end over to the left here. Yes, good. I'm not sure how many more items we need to collect in the maze here, but I want to be thorough. So this should go around. Whoop, 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 whoop. Okay, good, 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 good. And this connects on the right here to the center room. Yes. So what's on the door here? Hmm. This looks like a coat of arms. Um, looks like kind of like bug eyes? Yeah, it looks like kind of like a proboscis and, and bug eyes. Not a fan of that. Okay, so if I go up here, there's another dead end all the way at the end of this hall. And there's also another room up here. Yes. Oh, this is the dagger room. Right, 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 right. Okay. We still need to figure out how to way to get that guy's like cord or whatever. Apparently, all of the daggers we have are dull, which is... Oh, another dagger. Speaking of which, is this going to be the sharp one? It's another of those ceremonial daggers. Yes. So which one does this have on it? Hmm. Okay, it has like a person it looks like, maybe? Yeah. So yeah, we have the red dagger, the silver dagger, the white dagger, and the black dagger. And we don't have anything... To use to cut that. This is Why not yeah. All the cool There's nothing sharp Smaller here, right? Darn. The pliers. Okay, and can't use any of the daggers. This is smooth. Uh, oh, I wonder if we could use. This has got a pretty sharp edge on. Ah, the broken lens. Oh, we could go do that. Oh, that feels like a. Ah, that feels like the right thing to do. Yeah, we should probably go get that. Okay, there you are. There you are, buddy. I need that hemp. I think it's hemp, he said? Aha. Uh -huh. Where did it go? <laughs> Wait. Where? Where's Where's the item? Lantern fluid. Uh, examine? I'd guess the cord is made of hemp. Yeah. Can I take Sounds it now? Real nice. Okay, okay. We just cut it. It wasn't going to be all in one. Okay. It's a cord made out of hemp. Too bad I don't have any zigzags. I heard this stuff burns real well. Burns real well. Okay, do we want to make a, like a torch? Let's see, hemp cord, what could I, can I put it in the, the lantern fuel? Uh, combine lantern fuel and the cord? Aha. Okay, so we soak it. Okay, great. So then <laughs> we have a primitive fuse. So it's not for a torch. I guess we're going to make ourselves an explosive. Maybe at some point we're going to use... Without a functional firearm. These aren't worth much. So I wonder if... I also want to combine these. Maybe I combine it with the jackknife? Yeah, I combine you and bullets. Aha, to open them up. For the gunpowder. Excellent. Jackknife with bullets. Okay, okay. I think that's what I want to do. Um, oily handkerchief with them, maybe? No, with you? Huh. Uh, do I want to put these in the bowl? Like, I'm trying to get the gunpowder out, I think. Uh, can we put them in the shields? No. Darn. Okay, I think we're on to something, though. Do you have anything else for me? Well, oh. the spear's still in pretty good shape. Okay, so you also have a spear. Uh-huh. Oh, 
That is quite a spear. Okay, so we have a spear as well. I didn't even notice that. When you, do you have anything else? Yeah, hold on. Are we missing anything else from you? No, I think that's it. Okay, thanks, friend. Uh, thank you for both the hemp and the spear. Much appreciated. Okay, so now let's get back onto the other part of the ruins. All right, good. Okay, so we have... On top of that, now we have a primitive fuse, jackknife with bullets. Oh, we have to examine it. Aha, uh -huh, okay. So now we have gunpowder. Okay, so now can we... Are we trying to make an explosive here? What would we... Uh, maybe combine these? Okay, put the gunpowder in the bowl. Uh, yeah, primitive explosive. Maybe put the fuse in it? Okay, okay. I still don't know where we're going to use this, but so permanent explosive with fuse. Okay. Uh, and nothing we can do with this yet, right? Nothing with the spear. So like nothing we can examine on this. Okay. Fair enough. All right. That's at least good. All right. So let's go back out over here and get back into the ruins proper. Yeah, this is, this is how I drew it. Up, and right, and then another left, right? Okay. And then, oh, there is something here. Okay, there is at least a dagger. I missed that. It's another of those ceremonial daggers. Okay, what do we got? We have a gold dagger. What does this look like? Okay, it looks like the full sun. All right, good to know. Good to know. Okay, and anything else here? I would have swore I'd, they were supposed to be. Okay, there is a room up here. Okay, I'm not crazy. Well, maybe a little crazy. This would be a good time to say it. we've done a lot. A lot. All right, so let's do a little increment file and save. Daggers for days. And open. This door won't open. Oh. I'll have to enter through another door. Okay. Now, that makes sense, I guess, because... On this side, so if this is a four-sided room, there's a side here and a side opposite, here and here. On this side, I have it that it's connected with a hallway from the dagger room. So I wonder if there's a puzzle in the dagger room that will open up that hallway then. Okay, okay, so let's go back. How did I get turned around up here? I must have just taken a wrong turn somewhere. Or maybe I literally just got turned around. Okay. Fine by me. I'm not going to complain. We got a dagger, and we found out where the door was. There we go. What is the symbol on this? The symbol on this door looks like some kind of giant insect. Okay, head. yeah, I thought it looked like an I insect hope there head. Aren't any critters this size buzzing around in here. Okay, okay, I, I did see that correctly. All right, let's go inside. As much as I don't think that's a good idea. There's an army of wasps in here somewhere. Oh, the that's not good. Be coming from that stone head on the wall. Okay. Uh, a couple of those buggers are coming out of the mouth, and if a few of them sting me, I'll swell up like an elephant and be dead in 30 seconds. All right. I either have to destroy that nest or get out of here. Uh, why don't we get out of here for now? Uh, let's try the dagger room instead. Yeah, why don't we try that? Aha! Uh -huh. I'm assuming that's the case. It's like a dagger. Not unlike the kind I'm carrying. Yes, we have several that look like this. I got this. a feeling these chambers are lined up in a sequence. I won't be able to enter this chamber uh, until I solve. Okay, so we have to fall. We have to solve the wasp, or, or the B room. The B room. Let's go through the B room so we can get to the A room or the D room. All right. Uh, do we want to try to get this ready? Primitive explosive fuse. We have a matchbox. So can I combine that? Like make this into an explosive, like lit. Okay. Yeah, I think that's exactly what we're doing. Okay. Whoa. Lit primitive explosive. And oh god. Uh use. Well, that won't work. Well, that's not great. That's extremely not great. Uh <laughs> so that's not gonna blow that up, huh? That doesn't seem to do anything. Oh boo. Uh can I can I stop this thing? Uh what else can we do here? Uh, can I can I put it on the spear? Can I like shove it in? Uh, where 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 was that spear? Ah, uh, there you are. 
and combine the two of you? No. <laughs> uh, can I combine with the shield? No. Can I combine you two? No. Oh boy. Uh, oily handkerchief? No. No. Oh, I can combine it with the spear though. Okay. This is good. And now, can I combine it with that? No. Can I use the matchbox on that? Yes. Okay. I'm flying by the seat of my pants right now. Uh, can I use this on that? This looks like a stone. Uh, use? Yes! Light it on fire! But now we unfortunately have a lit explosive in our inventory. Okay, but we no, got rid of those. That stone head, but a big pile of wasp crispies. All right, so we got rid of the wasps. I'm not sure if this bomb is gonna blow us up, but I guess we'll figure that out in time. Uh, so what is this? There are nine empty squares on top of this altar. Nine empty squares. Okay, so are there puzzle pieces in this room, like the room that we were in previously? I don't see any squares around here. Oh, 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 what do we have over here? These tiles look like they can be uh -huh. laid out. Ah. Uh -huh. Okay, so we have the nine tiles here. Perfect. So, what happens if I look at this? No, it's fine. It's fine. I'm not going to look at it. If I look at it, it can't hurt. If I don't look at it, it can't hurt us. There we go. Okay. Uh, I'm assuming I can rotate these. Yes. All right. So that definitely looks like a person standing. Uh, am I supposed to be able to discern? I mean, I'm guessing the, the maybe the clothes patterns. So they're all holding something different. They all have... Similar, but slightly different shoes. Okay, I'm not sure which one I'm... Like, is there a clue in the room about who's supposed to be who? Who's wearing what? what who's carrying what? You're carrying a dagger. You're carrying a spear. You're carrying a shield. Uh, you have slightly different colored footwear. We have orange. Seems like orange is your color, maybe? Uh, or maybe it's yours. You got orange on everything. Yeah. That seems correct. Orange here, orange here. Uh, then maybe your head goes here. Okay. Uh, you seem very purple-oriented, so maybe you're here and then you're there? Aha! Excellent. There's nothing more I can do here. Okay, there's nothing more you can do here. That's not exactly the most helpful. Uh, <laughs> I guess that was just the solution to this room's puzzle. So I can take a right up here. Yes, okay, this is good. Okay. Left, right, and then I'll go down this little corridor here. Yep, no, this is perfect. We know exactly where we are. Perfect. All right, so now we can go into the dagger room. All right. Be careful of daggers. Oh, there's something on the wall here. There's a moon symbol over this door. Okay, so that's a moon symbol. I would not have put that together. Okay, what do we have here? Solder has five slots carved into the stone top. Looks like something needs to be inserted into the slot. I mean, we have five daggers, right? Gold dagger, red dagger, silver dagger, white dagger, black dagger. Okay. I mean, that seems pretty straightforward. But the question is, in what orientation? I guess let's just try adding the daggers and see what happens. Okay. So, what happens when I add them in? Like, how do I? How do I? How do I? make them go I can't rotate them okay hmm so this is the moon this is the eclipse this is the sun are they supposed to be in order so these are the stars um how okay so they can just pop in okay hmm this is confusing what kind of what hint have we had for this is there anything on us? Like, does the shield have an answer? Like, is there like a clue on this thing? Um, not that I can see. Anything on the papyrus? Can I combine these? Like, do these combine? No. Yeah, the order of this. Is there anything on the walls here? So, here are the star symbols with the moon over the door. This is the eclipse symbol with the stars and the moon. So is this trying to tell us an order? Oh, see, that looks like the symbol. 
Whatever, whatever this is. Oh, is this actually telling us? Oh, it is. Look at that. Oh my God, I didn't even notice this along the door. So it is, I think, the eclipse symbol, the sun symbol, the moon, the stars, and whatever that is at the bottom. Yeah, it's the same across all of them. Okay, but it's by height. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So if you, looking at the altar, it's not just left to right, it's top to bottom. Okay, okay, hold on. I'm just going to quickly draw this. So eclipse, sun, moon, stars, and dude. For, for lack of a better <laughs> symbol, it's dude. Uh, so dude, stars, moon, sun, eclipse. Okay, I think that's the answer. So let's use the black dagger on here. So I think that means you have to be up to here, right? Because you're the highest. Um, if if you would be so kind. And then you go here. Perfect. Excellent. And then you... Oh, and then you go here. You go here and you go here. That sh At least according to the totem thing. Like the, the symbols on the wall... How do I make you go in again? <laughs> please, please enter your sheaths. It just happened before. How did how did this happen? <laughs> like, do can I just drop, 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 drop? There you go. So it seems like I just have to drop them onto it somehow. Okay, this the, this is at least the order going from top to bottom. This might be wrong. We'll see. Okay. If you'll go in, I need I need you to go in first. Oh, there we go. Okay. So that unlocked, I'm assuming, the door that leads to the last room around here. The question is, which door is that? I don't remember where we came in. I think we came in here? I guess we can quickly see. Whoa, come on. Uh, open you. I think this is where we came in. I guess I can open all of these just to check. They're all the same image, aren't they? <laughs> okay, so this should turn right, and then this should go left and right. Okay, so if that's the case, then the door that leads to the hallway that I think was previously locked is the one on the other side of this. So let's go over there real quick. At least according to the way I drew the map, so this should go up and then take a right. Yes, excellent. And we still have a primitive explosive device that I am very concerned is in my inventory. So let's very carefully save. Uh, <laughs> increment file and save. Uh, there's a bomb in my pants. Oh, actually I could, yep, there's a bomb in my pants. Yep. Perfect. Don't see how that could be misconstrued. All right, let's open up this. Aha. Let's step into the Pentagon chamber and take a look around. Suddenly, What's in here? The floor tilts sharply. Oh, that's not I'm good. Sliding into a dark tunnel. Okay. Hope you hope you brace yourself. Oh God. Oh my God. Tex. 